Hello everyone out there, you're welcome. This is Kingsley from Kingsbed Designs. If you're joining me for the first time, I want to encourage you to please hit on the subscribe button and also don't forget to hit on the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any video each time I upload a new video. Okay, in today's story, I'm going to be showing you how to actually pick a particular part of an a vector design or a part of your design. You want, actually want to export it and you don't want to start like I think more, what most people used to do let me say for example I need to export this particular image this one I need to export it separately I have to copy it or cut it out and create a new page and then insert it there before exporting differently no so right now I'm going to be showing you how to export this even from here as it will work because if let me show you something now if I try to export this particular image now let me export it let me put it into a folder let me see this folder and then rename, let me name it as this and if I try click on export now you see that everything on that particular page is going to be what will be exported like for example I think it's actually trying to load up you can see it's actually everything that comes up on your preview window you can see I have everything on that particular page yeah so now I'm going to show you how to actually okay let me save this let me just save this for the meantime okay I've actually saved it like that okay now let me now show you how to select specific objects in this thing to actually save out like now let me select this particular one let me say I want to print export this in all in particular what I'm going to do is when I export click on the exports now this is the first one I saved so now let's see now I'm exporting only that particular shape that I selected now come here you know by the time I select you can see I actually what I did was I selected it first I selected the shape first I want to the actual one I want to export then come to selected only you're going to tick on this now let me rename this let me see one so that it won't be the same thing with this so selected only then I'm going to click on export this is a format I, I'm exporting it as JPEG then export so when it comes out now you're going to see that it is only that particular one I selected that is out so the other ones that are together with it is not actually selected here so now let me just click on save and see okay now Another right, thing I'm going to be showing you, okay, what if what I wanted to print to actually export is not the whole of this, maybe it's a particular section in this particular design, it might be from this, any of the design. So now let me actually use this now. Let me go inside and do something. I'm going to take out this particular section. Let me cut it out. Now finish editing let me paste it here and see okay now let's say it is only this particular one I want to export now as I select once you select it now you are going to do export again so now let me also rename this to something else let me say two selected only make sure it's ticked then click on export you can see this time around it is only that particular one I selected that is selected actually okay you can see it's having a white background this is actually because I used I chose JPEG when exporting it okay now let me go back and choose PNG file and see selected only let me use PNG what's my PNG okay PNG selected only then export then you are going to see that the background 
is no longer white it's a PNG file so it can be transparent you can actually use this in another this in without like in form of a logo you can actually use this so that is just how to actually select a particular piece from here you mustn't actually have to select maybe copy the work from here and create a new page like how most people used to do create a new page and paste before exporting from here directly so you can see this will actually save your time and work the stress of you copying it to another page so now i guess you might have learned from this particular video in case you've not yet subscribed to my channel please hit the subscribe button and don't forget to hit on the notification bell so that you get notified each time i upload new video okay thanks for this this year i'm going to stop for now until next time bye